here with Charter Oak standout wide receiver Dennis Rufus. Dennis, can you talk about right now, um, there's a lot of colleges looking at you right now. Um, the Pac-10, there's at least half of them. Uh, where, is, where are you at in that decision-making process? Um, right now, I'm uh, talking a lot to Utah and Boise State. UCLA, I haven't talked to them in a while. Uh, San Diego State's in the hunt, and that's about it right now. Talk about the season you guys expect to have. I mean, obviously, you're going to be the go-to guy in this group. you got Josiah Thrope also at wide receiver, and Travis Santiago's looked extremely sharp out here. What are you anticipating offensively? Um, we look, we're, we're getting better on offense. Uh, spring, we were kind of shaky, but uh, over the passing league in the summer and all that, we're getting a lot better, and as you can see now, we're working pretty hard. Our coaches are working us out here, and... Uh, we're ready for game one. I mean, this is your senior year. What are you expecting from yourself? There's there's so much anticipation to watch you and, and, and see what you're going to do this year. I know i got to uh, come out, play hard for my team. My team's going to feed for my energy. And I know how it feels to play on a winning team in a winning season. So, you know, I just got to come out and play, and my team's just going to follow after me. We're going to come out, and we're going to be ready. Being one of the, the biggest, I guess, Division One recruits in the area, can you talk about going to the Sierra League and, and being in the Inland Division, which is the equivalent of Division Two, for a player, I'm thinking this challenge has to be intriguing for you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, it's really, it's, it's a challenge. Everybody counting us as an underdog, but, you know, just Charter Oak football, we ready. We, we'll take on any challenge. We're not scared of nobody. When it comes time, put the ball down and line it up. I mean, is that exciting to, to find out where you're at? I mean, you kind of, the last two years winning championships, you've you dominated it. You looked how you guys went through the, the Miramonte League. You shut everyone out. You had to shut out in the championship game. I mean, going into this, I mean, you open up with Glendora. Um, and when you think of your league and division, this has to be exciting for you guys. Oh, yeah. Um, I mean, the challenge is there, isn't it? Yeah, it's a challenge. Uh, that's what I've been telling my coaches for the last two years since my sophomore year. We need to play harder teams. I'm, you know, Miramonte is a cool little league, but, you know, we, we it's pretty easy. But uh, now we got the harder teams, so we're going to see what we're, what we're made of. Lastly, uh, Travis Santiago, can you talk about how far he's come along? Man, <laughs> Travis, he's he's come a long way. He uh, Sophomore year, he had that big game against Rancho on TV and all that, and uh now he looks a lot stronger, and arm got a lot stronger, and he's on point. We're on point. We've been working out in the offseason together, and we're pretty ready. There you go. There you have it. Dennis Rufus of the Charter Chargers. Thanks, Dennis, for joining us. Thank you.